Hi friends, today we'll see how to use tags to classify and analyze leads and opportunities in Order 50 CRM. So tags are unique identifiers which work like keywords or labels that help you to categorize and analyze your works as well as make objectives and goals clearer and available for everyone instantly. So from CRM, you can see from the pipeline view itself, here for the opportunity, you can see a tag product. And for this opportunity, office design and architecture, you can see some tags like information, training, consulting. So you can add tags, set colors for them, and you can make use of these tags to classify your opportunities. So when you open an opportunity here, you have the field tags. So for this opportunity, global solutions for niches, we have already added a tag design and you can add uh, more tags like software. Then here you can change the color of your tag. So when you click on that tag, you can find the other options. So you can change the color. Then if you want to add a tag and if you don't want to see that in your Canva view, then you have the option to hide it. So yeah, I have added a tag information and when you click on this, you have the option to hide this in Canva view. Now, when you save this and come back to the pipeline, you can see that information tag is not visible from the Canva view. In same way, you can add tags inside your leads also. Then if you want to create a new tag and use it for your leads or opportunities, you can come under configuration where you have a menu tags and just click on create button to create a new one. And you can choose a color for your tag. And if you don't want a color, you can use this option. Now here, when you search for repair, you can find that tag added. So this is how we add tags for your leads and opportunities. Then it's also possible to set default tags for your leads or opportunity. So that can be done when you're creating a lead mining request or defining visit to lead rules. So these are lead generation techniques. And here you can see a lead mining request already created. So here we have an option to set default tags. So whenever you're creating leads using this lead mining request, then those leads will have these tags. And same way, Inside a visit to lead rule, also you can set a default tag. So the leads or opportunities created using this rule will have these tags as default. And now we can filter our opportunities using tags. So here you can see. By default, there is no option to filter using tags. So you can add a custom filter. Here you can choose action needed. There you can find the field tag. So here you can add a tag name. Like if you want to view opportunities with tag product. So here you can see we have three opportunities with tag product. Then you can also group your opportunities by using tags. So here you can choose a custom group. 
and apply. So you can see our opportunities are grouped by tags like product, software, services, design, training. So then you can also use these tags as a parameter when defining domains. Like here, you can find our sales teams. And you have the option to set assignment rules where a domain can be set. So here, when you edit, you can edit the domain and here you can add filter. There you have the option to search for the field tag. So you can filter out opportunity with a particular tag. So you can see I have added a condition tags contains repair that is opportunities with tags repair so you have one record then you can also use tags inside your reporting so you can get information you need in an organized format like if we have different reporting dashboard forecast leads analysis report pipeline analysis report, activities, lead generation views. So if I open my leads, here I have option to add custom filter. Again, you can add a custom filter. So, Tagging lets you easily sort and filter out works and help you to boost your productivity.